We are 16 days into the new year, and the Angels are still undefeated in 2021. Angels fans, this is Matt Rostoff here with you. I hope everyone is having a good start to the 2021 year. I am here to announce that the Angels, well, this happened on Friday, and I'm sure you know about it, but for those who don't, I am here to tell you that the Angels have signed a player. Oh. I know, but it's not a pitcher. I want them to get a pitcher. They haven't got one yet. The Angels signed catcher Kurt Suzuki to a one-year, one-and-a-half million dollar deal. Kurt Suzuki, who is currently 37 years old, is a local to the Southern California area as he went to Cal State Fullerton. So some of the Angel fan accounts on Instagram didn't really take the Kurt Suzuki signing too kindly. Uh, I think it's a very mixed bag of opinions. Honestly, not a horrible choice. For a catcher, like JT Real Muto was available, but that could have put us over the luxury tax if we were to hypothetically get Trevor Bauer and JT Real Muto in the same offseason. Uh, this signing could work. It's only a one year deal. Like, I know Stazzy sort of had a breakout season in the, sh in the shortened season that we had in 2020 because of the pandemic that is still ongoing, but I think. Kurt Suzuki could do decently behind the plate. I mean, he's he has hit a little bit in years past. His career high for home runs was 19. So a little bit of info on Mr. Suzuki. He was a second round draft choice of the Oakland Athletics in 2004. 67th overall. The Angels are the fifth team he has played for, or they will be. He has played for the aforementioned Oakland A's, the Minnesota Twins, the Atlanta Braves, and the Washington Nationals. Some other stats, he has a career 259 hitter, which is not terrible. I think that's okay. A 708 OPS and a third, about a 31 in the on-base percentage. So a little bit less than a third of the time he is getting on base. Please tell me your opinion of the Kurt Suzuki signing in the comment box below this video. I really would love to hear from you Angels fans or any other baseball fans who happen to be watching this channel, even though it has me in it. Be sure also, my friends, that you check out QuackCast, my hockey series on this channel where I do the Ducks games. I will try to get that video out to you tomorrow or sometime soon, recapping the fir our first two games which were both against the Golden Knights. It was a 5-2 loss in Game 1. I'm hoping Game 2 goes a little bit better. Now, before I leave you all, please be sure that you tap that thumbs up button as hard as you can, and be sure to leave a comment in the comment box below. But most importantly, hit that red subscribe button. And if you, feel, and if you really want to do it, click the bell up there to turn on notifications so you know when I upload videos. If the Angels do somehow end up getting Trevor Bauer, I'm going to drop a great video on that. I hope they do, so I have the chance to do it. If they don't, um, that would be a shame, honestly. We'll just have to see where it goes. All right, everyone, that's all for me today. This has been Angels fan Matt. Stay safe, go Angels, and remember Angels fans, for these first 16 days in January, the Angels still are undefeated.